I think another story that was important for this year that was probably somewhat overlooked because of the MAG7 and its dominance in the media is what value premiums were in other markets around the world. So here we're looking at international and the blue bars here represent uh, the value premium. And you see here outside the US, very strong value premiums in both developed markets and emerging markets last year. But what also should be kept in mind is that if you look over the past three years, whether it's the US, whether it's developed markets outside the US or emerging markets, incredibly strong value premiums relative to their historical averages. So here up on the top, you see the long pull averages and there you see the value premium. So while there has been a lot of focus on this big negative number here, uh, I think it's always important to celebrate uh, where the premiums have been strong and the periods over which they have been strong in recent times.